Hey there, this is Stacy. I hope everyone's having a great day. I thought I'd come on today and do a little haul video. I went to Ulta with my daughters and then my daughter wanted to go to Claire's to get her ears pierced, um, double pierced. And so we went ahead and did that. So when I was there, I saw this really cute polish. Um, check this out from Claire's. And I can honestly say I have no clue how this is gonna go on, but I thought that would be really fun to try. It's all the neon colors, um, pink and yellow and purple and green. How cool is that? So I'm gonna try that on my toenails probably um, to see how that goes on. I'm hoping that it kind of goes on with like a tie-dye type effect. So um, $5 at Claire's, kind of fun. Then we had run into Ulta because I wanted to get some shampoo while it's still on sale. So this time I thought I would try the Joyco brand and this is the Color Endure. And so this one's the shampoo. It's the big, huge jugs that are 33.8 fluid ounces, which is one liter for only $14.99. So I needed some more shampoo, so I picked that one up as well as a conditioner in that same family. They had like lots of different kinds, you know, moisturizing and other, but I wanted that because I recently colored my hair, which I will talk about in another video. So I picked that up. Then I also got this Jergens Natural Glow and Protect. It's their new daily moisturizer with the gradual natural looking color, supposedly. Um, self tanner. This is the one for fair to medium skin tones. This had come in my Allure Beauty Box and I gave my daughter most of the products from that because she likes all those kinds of things and um, she was very very impressed with this and I thought the tan looked really good on her legs so I thought what the heck I'll try it myself so I bought that one. Then I picked up the hair milk from Carol's Daughter and so this one is the Curl Definer. Obviously, I've gone with straight hair here today. I straightened my hair when I washed it a couple days ago. But this one, um, I like to use on my hair um, different products for when I do decide to not dry my hair and kind of have a curly sort of a day. Um, as I'm getting older, my hair is getting a little more curly. So it's kind of fun and different. I, I like it. I think it's just kind of fun to be able to have the variety. So anyway, I had some other stuff that I ran out of that I had a sample of and I couldn't remember which one it was. So then when I went to the store, I found this instead and it was only $6.50 and the other one was just a big bottle and I don't use it that often. So anyway, I thought I'd try this one. Let me know if you've ever tried it. Hair Milk from Carol's Daughter. And again, it's the Curl Definer. Then the last product I got there is from Bedhead and it's called Sugar Dust. Um, I've been wanting just kind of a volumizing type product. I've never used this. I've gotten my hair done where they've done my hair and when they tease the crown area, they put in um, one of these types of powders that kind of helps to keep the hair lifted and in that um, teased sort of look, you know, with the volume. And unless I use something like this, it doesn't really stay. So I know that Lisa had shown, Lisa Lisa D1 had shown some Shu Umera stuff that she had gotten and I would love to have that, but of course they don't sell that at Ulta, and I haven't really been in very many stores lately. So anyway, I picked this one up. Let me know if you've used it and what you think. Um, it feels like there's absolutely nothing in it, because I guess it's just really light and powdery, um, and it was about $14.95 for that. And then I thought I'd go ahead and just quickly share with you my Glossy Box for this month. Glossy Box program, I believe, is $21 a month and you just get some fun products. And I love the boxes that they use, this nice, big, sturdy pink box. And it's just so great because you can store things in it. So they send you like just a little magazine type of thing here first. Then you always get your little card that tells you what's in your box and what the price is on full size products. And I'll just show you what came in mine. Maybe the same as everyone else's, I'm really not sure. Um, Let's see here, Ofra, O-F-R-A, I don't even know, Eyeshadow Ice Go Black, no clue, never heard of it, which is kind of good, it's kind of fun when you've never heard of the products that are in there, so I guess that's my color, Go Black, interesting, it must be so, uh, it's kind of like a cream shadow, kind of like in a little um, container that looks like a lip gloss. Now, probably wouldn't be too pretty on the lips, but there it is. Wow, it's got some serious color payoff. 
um, it's kind of a, more like a dark steely gray kind of a color. Not sure if that's for me, but I might try it. That might end up in my daughter's. My daughter does good, both of them do makeup better than me uh, when it comes to that dark stuff on their eyes. I obviously go neutral almost every day. So I'll let you know how that one goes. Wipe that off. Um, the next thing here is um, a shaving cream, Smooth Shave Cream, Fab Legs from First Aid Beauty. Then a Nahava product, and it's the Velvet Cream Wash for sensitive skin, which I'm thrilled about. It smells wonderful. So I'll just put that one on the side of the tub here. The next product is um, from Wella. It is for fine and normal hair, Wella Professionals. And this one is a moisturizing treatment for your hair. Just in a tiny little container here. It smells great. And I am very sensitive and picky about my fragrances that I use, but um, that smells fabulous. And again, that's from Wella. Then there's some um, V Beauté. I never nourishing repair eye cream, the intense brightening agent called Light Up, and then Buying Time is their everyday cream. So three little samples of some products. They're paraben free, gluten free, fragrance free, nut free, oat free, dermatologist tested and not tested on animals. So um, I've not heard of them. I will um, look that up and let you know what I think of those products at some time. And then the last thing is a perfume, an organic perfume. And I just comes with a little sample there, a little tube here. And mine, they sent me, was the Urban Organic. It says it's a sweet lemon sorbet with bourbon. Hmm, that sounds good. Sounds good enough to eat. Um, but with bourbon, tangy, lime, peel, basil, ginger, and smoky velvet. A daytime perfume, fresh and citrusy, lavender and grapefruit make the most delicious combination. and I agree, that sounds really good. So um, that's what came in my glossy box for, I guess that's the June one. And like I said, again, it's $21 a month. It's one of those programs that you um, can get just a monthly subscription to. So that's everything I had to show for today. I hope everyone's having a great day. If you have any questions, let me know. Please visit my blog. I'm kind of working on building that one up. I I'm at over 100 followers, so I'm going to do another giveaway on there. And that's about it. I hope everyone's having a good one. I will see you all again soon. Thanks so much for watching.